Well, good morning, God bless you. Amaryllis man reporting for duty. I've had some requests from individuals to go into a, a little discussion about why you force your amaryllis bulb into dormancy. Let me start out by saying here in Florida, we do not winterize our amaryllis bulbs, but they grow year round. There are only two reasons for uh, a dormancy period for an amaryllis. One is to keep it from freezing, and the second one is to force it into dormancy so that it will bloom around the holidays or at a time period that you choose for it to bloom. So I'll deal first with uh, winterizing your amaryllis. There are two ways you can do that if you're in a cold climate to keep your amaryllis from freezing. You can simply tear them in in your pots and turn them on their side. Cease watering. Keep them in a, in a dark, cool place and they'll do fine until the spring. Uh, if springtime comes, you might want to uh, repot them in fresh soil. Uh, another method for winterizing your amaryllis is to unearth it. All right, party roots here. As I've done here, and then trim back the foliage. And if the root system is real extensive, you can even cut it back some, like so. And then put that baby into a basement area, a dark area, the coolest place you can find in your home, and uh, leave it exposed to air and then come spring, it'll be ready to replant. So that keeps your amaryllis bulbs from freezing. Again, here in Florida, we do none of that. We just leave them outside and they grow and grow and grow. So it's not a requirement, but it is a method for keeping them from freezing. The second reason for a dormancy period for your amaryllis is to get it to bloom when you'd like to. I can take this bulb that I've unearthed and trim back the roots on and the foliage and refrigerate it for about uh, eight weeks, which would serve as a winter period of rest for this bulb. And then it could be planted after two months and approximately six to eight weeks later it would bloom. This bulb was prepared for Christmas blooming by unearthing it in late summer and refrigerating it then for a couple of months and here we are in November and I can plant it now and if it sprouts a stalk or, or flower scape right away, we'll have a Christmas bloomer. So I thought that might be helpful for some of you. It's not complicated, it's simple, but maybe you'll benefit a little bit with what I've shared. Come see us on our eBay store. We carry amaryllis bulbs, plants, and seeds, plenty of them. God bless. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.